Other people. This is the Kermit Show. What do you think about Pocahontas? Hmm. But if you walk the footsteps of a stranger, you'll learn things you never knew, you never knew. That's not it. This is a real Pocahontas. Okay. So we're going to interview Pocahontas. So give it up for Pocahontas. Alright, so, hi Pocahontas, we can go. Alright, so, <laughs> um, so the reason I have you here and the Kermit show is because we think that you're, in, like, really important. So, what made you important to Jamestown? Well, I made friends with John Smith, mm -hmm. as you've heard. Yeah, as I heard. She said heard, not heard. Anyway, go ahead. And I provided food for Jamestown. They had a horrible, horrible year called Starving Time. Mm -hmm. Devastating. So, what we heard right now was that you helped Jamestown not start to death, right? So, what made you stop going because of the Starving Time? Well, as you know, I was really, really good friends with John Smith. Mm -hmm. After they Colin, after the colonists told me that he was dead, I was in mourning. I didn't want to go back to Jamestown. It brought back me too many memories. So the reason why you brought food to Jamestown was because of Smith? He was always nice to me. Really interesting. Do you need shoes right now? Look at your shoes. Horrible. I think you need... Cortez! Or baby fat. So welcome back to the Kermit Show. So Pocahontas, what is another reason for you to be in the Wall of Fame? Well, I help the Native Americans mm -hmm. and the colonists find peace and harmony with each other. I was their source of food, and John Smith, oh John, if you would have met him, he would have been your best friend. But he helped me. Because my father kept telling him, telling me actually, mm -hmm. that he didn't want the pale faces to take our land. He wanted a fight. He wanted a war. Can you believe that? A war. But no, I told John Smith our problems, and he helped. He told the colonists my situation, and the colonists respected it. That's why I kept visiting Jamestown, as they called it. You know, we called it Watomek. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you know. Alright, so, well, I think that she should be in the Wall of Fame. Now let's ask other people what she should be in the Wall of Fame. So that was the story of Pocahontas. Now let's ask somebody else why Pocahontas should be uh, Miss Kurt's Wall of Fame. All right, so let's ask him one other person, okay? Let's go. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, hey, little girl. With the hair. Hi, what's your name? Jennifer. Hi, Jennifer. Alright, so, um, can I ask you some questions? Yeah. Alright, so, um, let's see. Alright, so, um, uh, what do you think about Pocahontas? Okay. Um, so, why do you think you should be in uh, Miss Kurt's Wall of Fame? Because she helps Smith. Smith. Alright, either. That's good. So, oh, um, Let's ask other people, okay? Come on. Oh, look, I see a kid. Let's go ask him. Hey, kid. Yeah. Um, what's your name? Uh, Kiko. Hi. Can I ask you some questions? Uh, sure. All right. So, um, why why should Pocahontas be in Miss Kurt's Wall of Fame? Well, she was just pretty much uh, important to American history and help provide food to Jamestown. In what year? 1607. Really? Hmm. Interesting. Yeah. Alright, so wasn't that fun, people? Interviewing some two little kids at Pocahontas. Thanks for watching the Kermit Show.
Now I got it! To the ground, nice. Wait! Is it recording? Welcome to the channel! I can't do it! Yay! Okay. Wow, what the? Are you turning now? Yeah! I didn't hear the click! Okay, stop it! Um. Again. What do you think about Pocahontas? Hmm. Why is it so cool? You think the only people who are people <laughs> are the people who are um, so why would, why would Pocahontas be in Miss Kurt's Wall of Fame? Because, um, she helps me. <laughs> Myth. Alrighty then. Okay, bye-bye. Um, uh, well, she pretty much was important to American history, and she helped, uh, John Town in 1607. Uh, James Town. Alright. So, wait, are you filming? Yeah. Okay. So, hi, Pocahontas. We got them. What does that mean? <laughs> Hello.